It looks like we have us a taker. It looks like he wants some fish. All right, so I think I'm supposed to crouch. Oh, he didn't move. I'll trigger. I'll trigger. No, you want more than two? You little pansy. Oh, and he's gone. There he goes. Dang it. I wonder if I can fish from all the way down here. All the way up here. Suppose so, but I cannot see <laughs> if I'm going to catch anything. I'm looking very closely. I can't tell. I figured two would do it because I heard people could get them on one. Dang it. Well, anyways, guys. Uh, hello, YouTube. It's Harley here. And welcome to another episode of RTD. Uh, we're playing on the new plastic texture pack. Uh, I am enjoying it, although the jungle wood looks pretty ugly. But everything else looks pretty cool. Um, I like it a lot. And I'm trying to get us a cat here. I want a pet cat. Since the update, I haven't uh, tried to get one. But now that uh, we're in the jungle biome, might as well get one. I mean, it's ideal. And uh, that's the whole purpose of the jungle biome is just for the cats, uh, the ocelots. Uh, I'm kidding there, but... But I would like a pet cat, uh, and I already know the name I want to name it for. I'll just name it for uh, the cat I used to have uh, throughout high school and stuff. Uh, we'll name him uh, Tipper or Her. Actually, my cat was a Her. But uh, we can, I mean, boy, girl, doesn't matter. I guess we'll find out. I don't know, like, uh, what kind of, which one we'll get. If it'll be a, a black, yeah. All right, I think we're going to need to get more than one. I don't know if it's going to be like one of those black ones or white ones. I don't think you can really tell the difference of the gender. But at least we can still name it Tipper no matter what. Because it's kind of a universal name to whatever you want to name it as. But anyways, guys, I uh, uh, apologize. Uh, this didn't come out earlier. I meant to record this this weekend, but I just didn't do it. Um, I'm being pretty lazy on uh, Minecraft. Mainly because, you know, GTA is out and... A lot of people are playing it. It's going, it's going crazy, uh, especially since the online's been fixed. Uh, it's pretty fun. I'm terrible at the game. I know that for sure. Uh, so uh, that's one reason why I, I haven't been playing much Minecraft, or I would have played this. W yeah. Okay. Let's try it again. Or uh, I would have played this weekend. No. Nope. Come here. It's a lot easier than everyone said it was. Yeah. We got some black cat. Meow. Alright, your name is Tipper. Even though you look nothing like my other cat I used to have. Your name is Tipper. Why do he sit? Does he automatically sit just whenever? The pigs look a little different in this texture pack. That's for sure. They're not as like red. They're like brown. But anyways, let me go show you what I've done up here. Nothing much. I spent like 20 minutes uh, during the night. Or I guess 10 minutes during the night. Because uh, the night time is only 10 minutes long on here. Uh, but I was just messing around uh, building our little area a little bit. I made this little stairwell up to the land. And uh, from there I'll expand on. And uh, made uh, some more stairwells down into this cave. And we'll build something down there. I don't know if I'll keep using wood or not. And then uh, I plan on making like a little dock area right here. And I like to have like boats and stuff. And uh, then I want to widen this out to kind of make it uh, accessible because it's kind of crowded. Take some of those vines out. And then we have us a nice lake, which is pretty cool. A little tiny island. I think we should definitely do something with that island. Oh, it kind of spans off into a river. That's that's pretty sweet. But we should def definitely do something with that island. It's kind of sweet. Um, and then, of course, we have this whole jungle biome. I plan on going through and trying to take out all these little trees, the small ones that are like one or two high, and then just kind of have big trees, maybe keep a few little trees for decoration and stuff, but I want to kind of just kind of get this whole area, just, I mean, I want it to look good, I want it to look nice, it's a lot of, uh, a lot of building though, and uh, I don't do as much building as normal, is that another cat? I guess so, man, these guys are spawning like crazy, it's first time, uh, I've seen uh, ocelots uh, up here, and uh, I've already seen two today, so that's, that's pretty wicked. But um, as for this episode, I really don't have anything extremely planned, so we're going to have to kind of uh, find stuff to do. Uh, there's plenty to do, I know that for sure. I need to, I need to upgrade my tools. Uh, I need to do some enchanting and stuff like that. We may do that. 
uh, probably take out the sugar cane too because it's it's not necessary since whoa hey what's up okay uh we need a uh, I'm so sorry I didn't mean to we need to find you a place to to kind of stash you because I don't want to have to punch you even though you can keep creepers away from me that's that's pretty cool but you're still you're gonna get my way is the problem uh, but I wonder if I can uh heal them I probably need fish can we take bread probably not probably need fish that is for sure all right so uh, I got a bunch of crap right here somebody gave me some slime balls which is uh, useful we'll probably use those eventually for some sticky pistons uh, let's see I think uh, what I want to go do now is work on some tools so I'm gonna head over to the spawner probably sit FK for a little bit I don't really know how long uh, Alright, this is the pins because, I mean, it takes forever. Uh, oh, I want to go show you the nether portal. If you don't have the texture pack, the nether portal looks pretty sick. It's pretty cool. Uh, it reminds me of kind of the other uh, the other texture pack a little bit. Uh, it has kind of the same feature, but it looks, it looks a lot uh, cooler than the other one. It actually makes sense. I mean, it's at least purple, uh, <laughs> unlike uh, the other uh, nether portal creeper. Creeper, creeper, creeper. Uh, unlike the other nether portal, it's at least purple. So as you can see, and then it has that little, that crazy look to it. Ooh, you change the looks on these guys too. Man, they look weird. See, this is why I need to upgrade my tools. That is bad. Gunpowder looks a little different. But that looks, that's pretty cool right there. I like the animation they got on inside of that. And uh, uh, cobblestone looks actually decent for a change um it looked good on the uh the the first uh, first uh, texture pack also but all right i'm gonna head down here and do some enchanting uh i'm not 100 percent sure uh, if i'm gonna do diamond tools or if i'm just gonna do something else somebody you clear out the whole side but you don't put water at the bottom oh my god people 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 yeah i know i died i know I know I died. <laughs> You're all freaking out because I died. Uh, you got to put water at the bottom if you're going to clear the whole side out. And I mean, that's hard to get back on. Uh, like the ladder with it on its side like this. Man, jeez. I swear. Some people. <laughs> oh, this is a mess now. All right, so my plan... I'm just gonna try to level up as much as I can, and uh, then uh, depending on like how long I sit here and uh, how high of a level we get, we may just do iron tools and just kind of enchant lowly, uh, low levels until I can get a better setup for uh, for enchanting because uh, it's it's pretty miserable sitting here for a long period of time. So we'll see. Uh, at the moment, oh, I hear him. I hear him now. Uh, yeah, I was like, at the moment, it's not going very well. They took out like the whole side too. I messed up the whole design whenever they did that. That's pretty inconvenient. Do I have any cobble? I can make that look a little better. But so I'm gonna sit here AFK for a little bit and then uh, I'll just kind of let you guys know what we what's the plan. All right, guys. I waited as long as uh, I could. I, I got the level 20. We're just gonna do some small level enchantments on some iron tools. Um, I'm looking for like, yeah, level three is decent. So, mainly efficiency because, uh, um, everything else sucks. <laughs> Unbreaking really isn't that hopeful. So, uh, efficiency is kind of what I'm looking for. Oh, unbreaking. Alright, what else can we do? I guess we can do my armor. Protection would be nice for this. Kinda wanna go smaller than that. There we go. Yeah, protection. Four. Protection. Uh, let's go smaller than seven. This cursor is really, really hard to get used to. Oh yeah. We're gonna have protection like crazy. I don't know how much we have left. Oh, we have four. So I have enough for one more enchantment on this helmet. But yeah, this cursor is uh, really, really hard to get used to on there. Aqua Affinity, interesting. Alright, cool. So now we're kind of suited up a little bit better than what I was. 
knock that off. I don't want to be a jerk to somebody else. <laughs> uh, that, that would be terrible. He's all coated, gold plated up. That's pretty funny looking. Somebody like these mushroom houses. I don't, I don't know why you like the mushroom houses. They look better on this texture pack than the other one, but still, they're not that great looking. And uh, all right, so let's see. I guess we can start working on uh, building something uh, around my area. Uh, I think uh, what I want to work on is that uh, dock uh, around the little ocean or a little lake that has a river. Okay, you, this cat is getting on my nerves. Swear it won't stay in one specific location. It just teleports to me every time. Oh, it drives me insane. Raw beef. If raw beef looks like, looks like bubble gum. Oh, I guess that's bones, I suppose. But it looks like bubble gum. Uh, but I think I want to work on that dock um, over there. I think that'd be kind of cool. We can make a stairwell down to it. And uh, I'll need uh, wood for sure. Um, let's grab all the stairwells and fences and stuff. And some lighting would be nice, but I don't have... I don't have any glowstone, so we really we're just gonna stick with torches for now uh, until I'm able to uh, kind of get more glowstone a little bit better. Then we'll work on that. Oh, uh, I don't know if anyone noticed my support beam there. It's pretty cool. <laughs> I thought that was a a good uh, a good place to put a support beam, and plus I wanted to get rid of some ladders, so <laughs> that was uh, the main reason. All right, so for a dock. I know it's nighttime, I apologize, and it is raining, but, uh, oh, and it quit raining, Ryan, <laughs> I said something, how convenient, and it's becoming daytime, um, but, I mean, the best place would be, like, right there, but it's not really convenient, I'll have to, like, wrap it all the way around the island, but, uh, I mean, this is a nice spot, oh, I can't really, there, I can't really tell, um, at first because if you look at it from like this angle it looks like the same level because the texture pack but I think I guess right here will be decent and I'll do some uh, terrain terraforming uh, kind of line this out a little bit and then we'll use uh, let's see it will have to use wood that's for sure and I think oak wood would probably look the best what does spruce look like uh, around this area that's jungle yeah, we don't have any oak. Look at spruce. That looks cool. Yeah, I like spruce. So I think we're going to use spruce wood. And then um, we can just kind of make this little dock uh, that extends out. Nothing too fancy. And then uh, put some boats around it. And then probably open up like a canal area over there somehow. Something. Something of that nature. Uh, bear with me because uh, I'm just going straight from my brain using complete creativity. I have nothing pre-built, so I have no idea what I'm doing. But I think it'll look pretty cool. So I'm going to work on this a little bit. Uh, save you guys from the boredom of uh, me just placing blocks and just kind of show you what I've got when I'm done. All right, guys. So um, I've kind of changed my mind. So I was just going to do like a dock like this and then just have like fences and porch or something. Uh, but then I started trying to make a stairwell down here and then I started doing this and I was like, and I was going to make a, like a walkway over to the dock. Well, I was like, well, why don't I just make this the dock? So that sounds like a better idea. <laughs> just make this the dock. Um, so I think that's what I'm going to do. Um, I think it'll, it looks fine. I mean, that's about what you want. You just want a place right beside the open water and maybe I could use fences for like lanes. I'll, I'll need to tear this one down because I don't want it protruding out. And uh, also I'll put some uh, fences underneath. Uh, they're for uh, support. You know, just kind of... Uh, I mean, they're not really there for a reason, but support. And uh, ideally, like in a real world situation, that's what you want. Uh, I know this is a video game, but whoa, that arrow almost took my face. Oh, it took me off that time. Uh, these guys can actually hit you underwater now, it appears. Um, I did not uh, know that until recently, uh, this episode. 
uh, I was getting bombarded with arrows while I was trying to swim underwater to dodge them because that's what I used to do. Uh, you can't do that anymore, apparently. So that's a uh, very inconvenient. But I'll I'll tear that down. Uh, it'll be kind of out of the way, and I'll have to worry about it. And then I'll add in some fences uh, to kind of support the area. And I think the fences for like a I don't know, just like a boat in general. So I kind of need to make a boat. We need a crafting bench down here, anyways. So let's go ahead and uh, place one down somewhere. Somewhere not in the way. Whatever. <laughs> I'll put it in the dead center for now. Uh, and then uh, let's kind of have an idea of what this boat would look like if we just kind of place it in the water. See how much room we actually have. Alright. And then uh, what I was thinking was, uh, I mean, you're not going to have perfect parking. But what if we did something like this? Or is this going to look absolutely retarded? Because, I mean, that's not, I mean, or will it completely mess up, like, how the boat works? I was afraid of that. I think it, it doesn't look very uh, pleasing either. It just looks like it's in the way. So, yeah, I don't think I'm going to go with that. It just looks like it's in the way. I have a feeling we're going to have boats everywhere, too, because there's no way of, like, guiding them to stay in one specific location. Um... Not that I know of. I'm sure there's probably a, a better way of doing stuff, but um, I really don't know of a good way of doing like a, uh, I don't know, like a gathering system to keep keep them here. Uh, so I think that's gonna be kind of difficult. But so this is our dock. Pretty simple. Uh, it's just a accessible way to get to the water from our treehouse. All you gotta do is go down some stairs, and it's looking pretty cool. I like this right here and, I mean eventually we're gonna start doing some decoration like this dirt wall oh I thought that was an enderman I was about to freak out <laughs> like this dirt wall isn't very appealing uh, so eventually we'll probably put some put some structure into it um, some color something something more than just uh, the brown dirt wall um, so just bear with me um, we'll get there eventually but uh, I think that'll is the boat sinking Oh, okay I was like, really? Are you kidding me right now? And then uh, I believe that's that's really it. I mean, it's pretty simple. Let's go over here and look at this area. Actually, let's try to get in the boat and swim over to it and see if we can fit through there. I may have to chop down some vines. And uh, that might be the only, only really issue I'll have. Maybe. I remember like the first time. Oh, oh. Uh, we can fit. This is really a tight squeeze. So we're gonna, we need to cut out some of this land. I remember like one of the first times I went through a, a crowded area like this on uh, the uh, alpha version. Is this one of these short trees? Let's just chop it down. I was uh just, uh, just trying to make land and it wasn't like with the, with this system I'm talking about right here. It was uh, just a land I seen a uh, shore or whatever, and I I went to end with my boat, and as soon as I did, there was a drop off, and I instantly died. Like I didn't fall or anything, I just instantly died. I wish I would have had that on camera, but it was like my first Minecraft world ever, and uh, it was it was pretty funny. Uh, I was kind of I was kind of unhappy about it, but I luckily knew my way back and was able to get all my stuff, but. I just I'm waiting for that to happen again on camera, but I don't think it will. Maybe I think it was a bug in the end. Uh, it was just a bug in the game, but I don't know. I'm not quite sure. All right, so this water is not gonna is not working with this. Uh, looks like I'm about to get some more buckets or something. This is uh yeah, this is very annoying. So I had to get some buckets of water. Um, I think that might do it. Uh, just probably get rid of these vines, and to do that, should be able to just hit the top of them. I don't want to. I don't want to take the tree down. Just want to get rid of the vines. What? Or do I take the shears? Oh, that works. I uh, just gotta make sure I get the like hit the top of them eventually. Uh, get those chopped down, and uh, I believe this three-way will work once I get some water. 
but I have a feeling if I get through there with the boat, I'm going to get stuck. All right, let's try to make a loop and go back around it. These vines look cool in water, but, man, they're very distracting. I wish they would fix the lily pad effect. Like, whenever you go across a lily pad, your boat breaks. I mean, come on, really? All right, so that, wor that works pretty well. Maybe take this corner out and uh, put some water in. I think that'll work uh, pretty effectively. And uh, now we have a little, a little waterway to where we can get our areas a little faster. Because um, uh, walking in the jungle is going to be a pain. I know that for sure. So I don't want to have to do that uh, nowhere near as much as I, I have to. So, But anyways, guys, I think that's all I got for uh, this episode. Um, we kind of got uh, more stuff done. Uh, kind of thought through a bunch of stuff. So... But I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of RTD. Uh, I, I recorded real late, so there's not many people online. I apologize about that. Uh, but I have to work a weird shift, uh, so I'm having to record at a weird time. So it's a, it's a little different. But I hope you guys enjoyed the episode, and I'll talk to you guys later.